So, Ghost in the Shell. Yeah. I've never seen it. I've heard so much about it. I remember it coming out in the 95 or 96. Yeah. We had direct TV, and they would always, like, just, they would run ads for the stuff they were showing on their, their on-demand channels, or whatever you'd call it. Right. On the pay-per-view channels. And this was constantly in rotation in those ads for, like, a year it was on their pay-per-view channels. And every time I would watch the trailer, I'm like, man, I really want to watch that. I really want to watch that. And then I never watched it. Ghost in the Shell with Scarlett Johansson. That's, see, I've been hearing a lot of controversy about the casting because of Cooper. that. Yeah. Yeah, there definitely was a lot of pushback on that. This is Major. I'm on site. They talked about it on Game of Reggae this week. Yeah, good actress, so. Yeah, but yeah, well, I'll talk about that yeah. after. Yeah. The title is so amazing. Yeah, they're nailing the style of that yeah. anime trailer I used to watch over and over again. You are the first of your kind, but you're not invulnerable. Maybe next time you can design me better. I don't like Scarjo. I don't even like her. Connected to something. Connected to something I'm not. That's awesome. Mm -hmm. What are you? Seems like they're nailing the tone. Again, of only the trailer that I've seen. Yeah. seeing that part yeah that part right there like the way she yeah camouflage like middle gear the stealth suit I don't know how to trust I trust me you know who does a great cover of this song I have a past Coil I'll find out who I was I'll play it for you later Yeah. Notice that part. I might have to watch it on IMAX. All right. Before, I, I think it looks cool. I think it seems like, again, I've only seen the trailer for the anime movie, so I don't know what the content of that movie is. But judging by the trailer I used to watch every day, a hundred times a day, because they played <laughs> it on DirecTV all the fucking time, they've kind of nailed the tone. Uh, a little darker than I remember the other trailer being, but they pretty much nailed the visuals and the tone. I'm doing a lot of weird hand movements today. <laughs> the last time I was on, it was weird faces, and today it's hand movements. All uh, right. Yeah, uh, the tone of it looks amazing. Uh, the visual effects and that look fucking awesome. Mm -hmm. I really want to see this, and I really want to watch the anime. I do too. We should do that and, first, though. Uh, yeah, we should definitely do that first, just to give it its uh, dues. Mm -hmm. um, I think Scarlett Johansson, like, I know people are giving her a bunch of shit for her, or the casting a bunch yeah. of shit for her. I think she looks great in this. I think she's going to do fine in this. I know she's a yeah, good she'll actress. Be, she'll be fine. I'm, I'm um, not a big fan, uh, but she'll be fine. She'll be yeah, fine. I, yeah, they so, didn't cast someone of her you know, agency. They were kind of talking about this on Game, Game Over Reggae. Not about this specifically, but this came up because they were talking about um, uh, Nick Scarpino, who's a film film guy yeah. was like his topic for the show this week was um how do you feel about hollywood becoming second in movie making second to whether it's vancouver or second to china because china's putting a lot of money into movies like that yeah. and i think this is one that they put a lot of money in and uh they did the same thing for independence day the new one which is why that movie is structured the way it is because that's what sells there um, they did the same thing for um, the Red Dawn remake that was they said no we're not going to show this movie here unless that. you change it and so they had to change <laughs> all the Chinese flags to North Korean flags yeah um, 
I saw that. And or read about that. Someone that does huge box office in China is Scarlett Johansson. And the theory is she was cast in this because China's putting a lot of funding into it because they're shooting a lot of it there. And they have to kind of bend at their requests, which has happened in a lot of movies lately. Um, I don't know if that's the case here. I think Scarlett Johansson's going to be fine. I Just because I'm not a fan doesn't mean that she's not good at what she does or that people don't like her. Because we all know I... Tend, it always tends to seem like I'm contrary for the sake of contrary, but I always have my reasons. And I just, I don't think she's as good as everybody thinks she is. Uh, yeah, I just, I'm not a huge fan, but she'll be fine in this. Uh, maybe she'll win you over in this, like Charlie Stern winning over on the other movie. Maybe. <laughs> uh, yeah, I, I like her stuff. I, um, she's great. Uh I, I'm, ex- I'm excited for this. Like, yeah, it I looks cool. It, it, visually, I think it looks awesome, and I think that's really what's pulling me in. You know, what I want to ask about this, Scott. Oh, I'd yeah. love to get his opinions on this. I'm gonna have to message him and see when he's free. The live billboards. To talk about awesome. this, yeah. Uh, so yeah, that's definitely something we're gonna go watch when it comes. Yeah, out. I want definitely. It looks cool. 